Algebra in area. Lengths of the shape are given as algebraic expressions and your task is to work out the value of the unknown if the area of the shape is given. You already know the following facts. Area means how much space a flat shape takes up. For a square and a rectangle, we multiply the length with the width to calculate the area. You also know the following algebra. You can simplify algebraic expressions by adding like terms. You can multiply algebraic terms with each other and you can solve algebraic equations with the unknown on both sides. Just a quick reminder about the adding and multiplication of algebraic terms. Remember that 2y plus 3y equals 5y, but that 2y times 3y equals 6y square and the square is only for the y and not for the 6. Example 1. The diagram shows a rectangle. All measurements are in centimetres. The area of the rectangle is 60 centimetres squared. Work out the value of y. Opposite sides of the rectangle are equal. We have that 3x plus 8 equals 2x plus 12. We subtract 8 from both sides to get 3x equals 2x plus 4. Now subtract 2x from both sides to simplify to x equals 4. We can now work out the length of the one side of the rectangle by using x equals 4 and the expression 2x plus 12. We have 2 times 4 plus 12 which equals 20. The area of the rectangle is 60 square centimetres. We now have that 60 equals 20 times y. y must equals 3 centimetres. Example 2. The diagram shows a rectangle. All measurements are in centimetres. The area of the rectangle is 80 centimetres squared. Find the value of y. To find the area, we must multiply the length by the width. Area equals 4y times 3y plus 4 and that must equal 80. It is important to remember that we must times the 4y with the 3y and with the 4. 4y times 3y equals 12y square and 4y times 4 equals 16y which equals 80. For this solution you will have to use trial and error. Let us choose y equals 3. Then y square equals 3 square, which is 9, and 9 times 12 is 108, and that is too big. So y must be smaller than 3. Try if y equals 2. y squared equals 4, and 4 times 12 equals 48, plus 16 times 2 gives us 48, plus 32, which equals 80 y equals 2. Example 3. These two rectangles have the same area. Work out the value of y. The rectangle A we have area equals 3 times y plus 30. This equals to 3y plus 90. For rectangle B we have 3y times y plus 2. This equals to 3y squared plus 6y. Area of rectangle A equals the area of rectangle B. 3y plus 90 equals 3y squared plus 6y. We can simplify this equation by subtracting 3y from both sides to give 90 equals 3y squared plus 3y. We will again use trial and error to find the value of y. Let y equals 4. 4 squared equals 16. Times this by 3 to get 48 and then add 3 times 4 which is 12. 48 plus 12 equals 60 which is too small. Try y equals 5. 
5 square is 25. 25 times 3 equals 75. Then add 3 times 5, which is 15, to get an answer of 90. The final answer is y equals 5. For more practice questions, subscribe to our website at www.11plusgenie.com and get full access to all our 11 plus online resources.